do a little preventive maintenance to this old tractor. I've got one repair that needs to be done to it, one quick repair. Then I'm going to hook up the Wood Max wood chipper and we're going to head out to the woods and get I cut this PTO shaft to fit my other tractor and it's too short, um, it's too long for this tractor. But what's cool about this thing already I like, I can pull this out and this will lengthen that part of the machine right there. So I'm going to try that and I think that'll work to fix it. man. If I knew that before, I probably wouldn't even have had to cut that PTO shaft. Guys, this is crazy. I'm running this tractor in here, and on top of this door, there's a bunch of spiders. So check this out. There they are hanging. See, there's one. There's one back there. There's one over here. Uh, they're just hanging down from this door. I don't believe they like diesel fuel smell. We'll just get started with these branches in the yard here where I pulled that log up the other day for firewood. So here we have this old poplar tree and it's old, big and old and ugly. But it's so ugly it's pretty and I hate trimming it but it, it just had to be done because uh, mowing under it was just too difficult. So let me get the chipper in position and we'll chip up the limbs.
Douglas, you back again? Old big Douglas. Come here, Doug. Old big dog. That is a fine doggy right there. So should you buy a wood chipper? Guys, I don't know. I can't make that decision for you. Every man needs to make his own decision on something like that. Some guys just want a set of grapples, grab all the brush up, throw it in a pile, let it dry out and burn it, you know, and that's fine too. The reason I got this wood chipper is for this valuable commodity right here. This, these beautiful wood chips. I have so many things I can do with them. I can use them in the garden. I can fill gullies and holes, just whatever, you know. So there's always going to be limbs and scrap trees around where I can chip up wood and use these wood chips. That's why I got it. You know, I don't play video games and stuff like that. So for me to come out here in the woods, listen to that tractor run and the wood chip, you know, the wood chipping machine hacking up that wood and blowing it out the snout of it. For me, that's awesome. If you're gonna buy one, guys, if you're looking into a, a wood chipper, I do recommend this Wood Max only because the price is right on it for what you get. It's hydraulic feed. I think it'll do six inch, six inch round stuff. And you saw me put some pretty big hefty stuff in there and it works great. Don't get a manual feed and don't get a small chipper. The bigger the better, and it, it needs to be a hydraulic feed. I can tell you that right now. So guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Don't forget to take your chainsaw out of your bucket before you go to spread your wood chips. <laughs>